we'll do some more Animal Crossing for a bit. I'm not sure if I'm going to do anything excessive today. We'll see. Probably do someone else's house. I think the other house I can do this pretty easy as Alice's, but we'll see. It's getting there. Like, I have very houses. I was going to get there in the end. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna, gonna do the daily stuff first, as usual. Oh, okay, so let's see. Okay. I might see what the list of critters are, as well. Stop watering these. I think if I've already got blue, it'll probably be quicker to just have the duplication happen. Damn. I'm just gonna check if that happened. Nope. <laughs> I don't know what the odds are, but. It has to work eventually. I guess until that happens, I'll keep watering the red ones. Take that long anyway. All right, that's that. Oh, right, because of the remodel. That's a fake. And then this is just preempting. We'll see if I actually go ahead with it, but I'll, I'll have the option. Crafting first. You're not. Wait, why are you dressed in an apron? Should have guessed muscles. Okay. Oh, cool. I got to go in here. Is that a house or a gym? Both. It's a gym that he runs that, um, he has, like, a little sleeping quarter in the back. Alright, I mean, this is growing on me more. Is this functional? Oh, it's not. Okay. Alright, admittedly, where this light is... A little problematic. 
That's fine. As long as you don't lie down. What are you making? No. I can imagine injury happening with that light though. Alright, but the look of this house is growing on me. Yesterday I was back and forth on it. I wasn't sure if I had done like something that was a meaningful upgrade. But I think it, it looks fine. That is a pipe. Wait, so if you combine all the bears, it makes a gigant- how gigantic? It has- it's 3 by 3 so I guess it's, it's pretty massive. Like this size. What, what would I even do with that? What would I even do? I don't even. I guess I'd have to buy the bears because I don't think I have them. <laughs> I don't think I, there's anywhere I could put it where it would it would fit. I mean, thematically and literally. Away. Get the daily stuff out of the way. Or I got to do anything else. I'll make one just because I'm intrigued. But I don't think I'll I'll use it for anything. It's just I don't know. I'm not convinced I can make it work. This is nice. I might buy a few of these. Oh, never mind, it only sells me one. But statement still stands, I just can't buy multiple right now. It's pretty unique. I did want to have someone sell home crafts, but I haven't done it yet.
Alright, let me change outfits. Trying to pick clothing that I don't think I own. Pretty sure. Probably got a hawk first. I don't think I. Oh, that's real. <laughs> Hold on. I was just waiting for me here. Oh, I just missed. It's been a while, honestly. I think it's it's been a few days since I last saw one. I didn't get close enough, that's fine. So I'll go to Happy Home first, get the recipe, buy whatever I want to buy, and then go to Halves. Then Daily Island, and then that's it, that's all the daily stuff done. I've gotten more used to doing this first because it's just better. I'm debating whether or not I want to, like, move the diner or just go simple and do Alice's house. Because Alice's house, the exterior is done, it's just the house. Okay, so th how involved do I want to get today? I've done a lot of landscaping lately. I'm getting every gold recipe except the one I want. Where is it? I think it goes to the top. Yeah, it's another one of these. I need the golden chest piece. I need the gold version of this. I have the head piece. Please don't get in my way, Pango. I just gotta check if the dog house is on site. Oh. I've been waiting. Oh, 
crossed. Oh, I mean, I'll probably buy that. That's useful. I want to get fancy with like a villager's walls. I can use that. Um, yeah, it's not here. All right, let's exchange, right? That's a good exchange, right? I'll probably s stop exchanging soon. This is just so if I get ideas, then I have multiple avenues to buy items. I'm only getting this purely just to <laughs> just to potentially get health so then I eat one and then it'll let me move two objects the money one I mean eh, it's fine Speaking of money. Daily Island next. Probably just gonna get the recipe. Unless it's just there's something going on there. So wait, if Celeste is here, does that mean there's gonna there's gonna be a meteor shower? Or whatever. It looks a bit cloudy. That's funny, it's playing his original song. I mean, maybe I should just save a bunch of Nook models and just go to random islands and get recipes that way. There might be a legit avenue to do that. It's just one more chance to be able to find what I'm looking for. 
Also gives furniture, so it's possible I could get the doghouse that way. I just want it for the turtle. <laughs> That's it. I just want it to look like the turtle has a feeding bowl, a pet bed, and a doghouse. Probably another one of these things because I'm actively looking for it. It's just gonna take forever. Yeah, not a whole lot going on here. All right. I think this is the same island I got yesterday. Oh, cool. Another pizza. I did want to try and make, like, a pizza place, so... The only thing missing is just actually being able to get mushrooms, which... I mean, I guess if I wait till the end of this month, I could probably get some. I guess I just have to shake trees now and then I'm good. I can't imagine there's going to be much 
things to get. In terms of fish and bugs and whatnot. Oh, right. I think I forgot to do this yesterday. It's kind of conveniently where I'm going to bury it anyway. I was gonna hit the, the blocks. Should be just one. Oh, I'll probably adjust this. Otherwise, it's gonna fall awkwardly. Because what I want it to do, I want it to fall directly under. So I'll move this across one. This is because it rained, that's why. So nothing grows here. that they're going to get in the way. <laughs> okay, it's fine. That is a weird way to flip raise it, no. They say that, but then in two weeks time someone's gonna wanna leave. I'm still not used to these new surroundings here. <laughs> Tree have oh, I haven't checked this one. So then, yeah, no. What? Oh, the I know what I haven't checked. I haven't checked these ones. There we go. That's just a kitchen scale. All right.
think we're ready to continue. all the rest of the stuff. I've been carrying trees because I don't know what to do with them. Kind of dead and getting rid of this one and setting up like clothing s stuff outside the shop as well, so it might lead towards that. It's not yet. Oh, distraction time. I heard it. <laughs> Come on. You know, the moment I look away, it's gonna happen again. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Ah, okay. So they're not that frequent. It's like once every minute or 30 seconds. I was taking a drink of water. <laughs> hey. Because I'm going to go indoors and then I'm not going to get to do this. This is not necessary anymore. I don't really have a spot that I want quick access to. I suppose a smart thing to do would be this. Place it here, and then put it next to the roses, so then these are the two things that I'm watering. So then I can just jump straight away to it. Which I guess at this point it may as well go here. There we go. I did have it there a while ago. Sure, I have that one. Hmm. 
it would appear not. Okay. Oh yeah, do they have... Rossetti model? For Groundhog Day. I'm glad I checked that. Bean tossing kit? I got that. A heart shaped bouquet. Chocolate heart. This Valentine's Day. I want the mask. I mean, that's fine. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, I'll, I think I know what to do with the Rossetti model. Just curious if, if it'll work, but... I have an idea for it. It depends how big it is. Alright, anyway. A resident's home. Alright, Alice is next. I mean, Alice's house is pretty nice looking. This is going to be pretty straightforward because I'm not going to touch much of what her house looks like on the outside. Okay, I think that's good already. Um, I might adjust the door to be just that. That's all. And then that. That's it. Like, Alice's house suits what's going on outside in the front yard, so... Don't have to touch it. On the inside, however... Alright, the only thing that I'm gonna keep, probably, is the kitchen. Everything else is just there. Eh. I'll keep the doll as well. Okay, so kitchen is going to happen. It's just going to be... And just for this, because I want to be different. It's going to be on this side now. Oh, what a change! How innovative. Yeah. Alright. That works. Uh, I'm just thinking. Let's mess around with... Hold on. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of the 
Oh, the wallpaper already dictates it. But... available. Pietro has another house that I could do. Because that theme is, is kind of set. So do that. This will actually work. And then... Didn't I make it a feature wall? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I want to use these for once, honestly. Okay. I'm not sure how I'm going to segment this room just yet. I mean, that honestly works. I don't mind that. Alright, floors. Sometimes simple works, though. Okay. Because then um, I can do this. That's too big. Has to be 4 by 4. That's 5 by 5. 4 by 4. Has to be 3 by 3. Mind you, that's not necessarily bad. And then just do something like this. For the kitchen. That's another 4x4. Four four. That one. Even though that, that's turkey day, it's like, eh, who cares. Or, hold on, give me this one. Yeah, that's better. Just looking at it. I think I got the idea right. Hmm. 
seeing what works. I can always swap out the brick as well, so. I don't know, I feel like it's over the top if I just do too much wood. towards those tiles, like that, and then just swap this out for something else again. Just do this, and it's okay. <laughs> Not that. Yeah, there we go. I think this is this is fine. It works. Alright, cool. Let's get some furniture. I think I use these chairs outside, potentially. I'll make it work. There we go. That works. Okay. Uh, so definitely these. That goes there. Oh yeah, I don't have a fridge. Where am I going to put a fridge? I guess I don't have to. Hang on. No, no. I got it. I'll think... Like how some of these places think. They have a, a spot for a fridge. My apartment does this. It has like a, a fridge hole. <laughs> I don't know how else to describe it. But that's, it's literally what it is. It's a hole for a fridge to go in. And then the woodwork kind of goes around it. I think it's the same he thing here. I mean, I'm trying to be different, and so I'm not using the same stuff over and over again. Where's fridge? There's fridge. Probably too big, right? Oh no. Okay, it does fit there. Yeah. I mean, this, this does work. Uh, hold on. Dude, uh, just thinking where this should go. I mean, I guess that's the thing about this is like now I have this free. I 
I'll play the music in a minute. Where is microwave? I don't know about using the color red. Alright, fine. Oh, no, it's okay. There we go. I don't know if I should put something on top of the fridge. I can. No, you know what? Let's not do that. I have an idea. This one I never used, but now this kind of makes sense. like an Aussie bird. They don't have Rosella, like Rainbow. Let's go for blue, that looks nice. Or, no, white. Just a dull. Yeah, there you go. But I gotta say I'm liking this kitchen so far. Definitely different to what I've usually done. Okay, so let's now mask the fact that the kitchen's there like this. And do it this way. There we go. That covers it pretty well. step. Yeah, hang on, let's see. I mean, it's fine. As long as it looks like you can sit. I guess if I mm, see that makes it tough because if I do this, yeah, I think this is the right call. All right. Now we make it matching. At least try to. I mean, that's fine. That's close enough. Or 
much. I guess now I changed the look of this. Can't put anything on top of that. Can I put something up here? Nah. I can put it on the range hood. Okay, so now the remainder is kind of... Hmm. What, what to do with the remainder? It, did she have a bed? I don't know if she had a bed. was bigger it'd be cool to have this layout but right now it's kind of causing problems about it. <laughs> like, what can I do in this limited space? I mean, I think this is probably the right move here. in terms of in terms of placing furniture that's fine do that it is a nice kitchen not to get too crowded here. Uh, what else is 
Das habe ich gar nicht. I mean, that kind of belongs in the kitchen as well. As long as you can still walk through. Whoops. There we go. I did want to keep the bookcase as part of the design, so... I think the only thing I might alter is the floor. Not a hundred percent sold on it. That actually looks kind of nice. I mean, for something that's like supposed to be Aussie in a shack, that works. I like it. Because you can't see the rest of it, it's covered. So it, it works surprisingly well. Now I'm messing with the color palette. thing, which is air conditioner, it's a must. The light switch will go here. So this is going to be like a tri-light setup. I wish I could hang stuff off this, but it, it does work pretty well. Oh, that's nice. What's that pattern that I used for outside? I think it was that one. Okay, there we go. Uh, plant, 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 plant. Here you go. There we go. I 
I don't think there's any like. Mm, I think the iron one looks better. There we go. This is getting there. Where is it? Because this actually features her. Yeah, it's kind of nice. play to the to the wallpaper pretty well. I'm trying to find similar sized ones. thing because these can hang and it looks like it's part of it. That's why this wallpaper is really good. You can do stuff like that. Yeah. But I figure if I do this, it should be okay. That might look good. sailing. Yeah. Alright, what else have we got for the wall? This could potentially work. Really? 
Okay. I think that's fine there. I don't know if I want to mess with this one too much. Probably gonna stick to the orange light and then it's just, yeah. Atmospheric. That's nice. This is probably the only time I've actually used the window normally. I've, I've always gotten rid of it, but now I think they've made it work. I think. I don't know. Right, put Alice here. I just want to get an easy thumbnail. Stay here. That's not bad. Alright, uh, I forgot about soundscapes. I'm gonna put like a nature one here. Hang on, how do you do it? It's like this. There we go. Yeah, beach. That's what we want. Nice. It's right next to the beach. I like it. She got to keep a nice kitchen. A kitchen was always the nicest thing in her house. Now I'm just taking it to another level. Yeah, cool. I'm happy with this. I don't think I spent that long on this one. I think I did that pretty quickly. All right, well, that's another house done. I think next time I'll do Getro's house. Because that one is just a swell. There'll be another house where it's a venue on the inside. Maybe the gigantic bear might make sense for Pietro's house. <laughs> just dedicated three by three areas to just the bear in there. I don't even know if you could put one inside the house. I want to see this again, this looks cool. Yeah, this is growing on me. I wasn't sure of it yesterday, but... Visually, it's growing on me. Though the kitchen... Eh, I mean... What I did with Alice's one is better. Alright. Neat. So let me see if I have the bears. It's all three bears combined. Okay, so there's Papa Bear. Yeah, I only have one bear. By the looks of it. Oh, no, hang on. Baby. 
But that's baby panda, not baby bear. I could buy them through Happy Home and it wouldn't cost much. Wait, what is that thing? What on earth? Oh. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Yeah, I might go order them through Happy Home. Then tomorrow I can craft it at least. Am I from Sydney? Ah, uh, nah. I am from Melbourne. First time anyone said my accent sounds Kiwi. I've gotten South African before, like a couple of times, but not Kiwi. But neither is, is what my accent is. See, fish and chips, see? <laughs> not Kiwi. <laughs> there's, there's the test right there. Beached as, yeah? What else? All right, it's this building. Yeah, my accent's the result of me speaking Spanish for like the first few years of my life. All right, Waddle. Uh, oh yeah, right, you can search here. Uh, so I need that one. You know, I'll just order all three. And then I can combine them tomorrow. There we go. No, I'm good. Anyway, how's it going, Frankie? Welcome. Can anyone tell... You know... With Americans, you can tell what part of the country they're from, generally speaking, with their accents, but I don't think that's the same for Australia, with the exception of maybe South Australia. Because they do that weird thing where, instead of saying chance, they'll say chance. Like, they just say fancy-sounding things. <laughs> That's the only Aussie accent I can pick up. The rest is just, I don't know. Maybe what they call a potato scallop? Yeah. What's the one state that has the weird one? Because it's between potato scallop and potato cake. But then there's one state that just has this weird one. I've always called it potato cake, because that's just what we call it here, but I can understand why that that is weird, and it doesn't sound correct. I, I get it. It's not really a cake. Potato scallop makes sense, because it's a, it's a deep-fried scalloped potato. I need to find that image, hang on. That's right, but there's, there's potato fritter. That's, that's South Australia. <laughs> potato fritter 
and then like a small region of, of Western Australia. I, th I thought it was South Australia. Surely cake is wrong. No, that's fine. Like, I, I get it. I like, I like my semantics. It's fritter. Potato fritter makes no sense. I'm sorry. That one... I'm not gonna have any of it. It's not a fritter. You save that for pineapple and banana. You don't- you do not have a, a potato fritter. <laughs> we can ban behind painting fritter. There you go. On common ground. Man, the other one was just, for the longest amount of time, Victoria had Safeway instead of Woolies. I just remember just tripping out the first time I went in a state and saw Woolies. I was like, what the hell is Woolies? Now, now it's Woolies. Now I'm used to it. I've just got to do the remaining of the daily stuff. Oh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. <laughs> South Australia is the only state I haven't been to. One, one of my friends from the... Asked me if I'd been to Perth, and I said yeah, and he goes, alright, cool, you flew over to South Australia, that's good enough. I mean, I'd like to go there, but <laughs> everyone that's from there, for some reason, just says, nah, don't go there. have like some freeway there that goes in one direction depending on the time of day which just it sounds insane to me Still getting used to just digging two holes to do this. to be the next one. You're out now I can chat about potato cakes later. No worries. Have a good one, dude. Man, now I kind of want one. I haven't had one in a while. Get some of that just, like, pure yellow chicken salt, man. Why does everything inevitably end up as food here? Alright. Oh cool, you're home. I can I can see your house now. I can see if I'm still happy with it. I think I'm still happy with it. 
That's kind of funny. Dude's, like, cleaning up. Like it's a place of business. Yeah, I mean... I like how this one looks. <laughs> the only thing... I'm still... well... I mean, uh, my head is kind of inside of the TV, but that's fine. It's like, it's minor. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, cool. Alright, well, I don't want to do any heavy construction today, but I'll talk about what my next plan for this is. So, Alice's house, I think, is, is done. With the new interior. Uh, so, I think the next house I should work on is Pietro's. Because that's low-hanging fruit. And I can't imagine that would take me long to do. Like, I just have to make the exterior feel like it belongs with the rest of this. And then the interior. I think it. I'm gonna keep all the items he has, it's just I need to structure it more like as if it's a carnival place. Like, Currently, it's just clouds in the void, which, I mean, it's fine, but... That's all I need to do, is just make this more... So, I think I'll keep the spinning wheels, and I might do, like, some pry, pry shells. I might just get rid of one spinning wheel. And then... Maybe set up a prize counter. These two chairs will probably remain. I'll think about it. I'm looking at it now, so then, like, imagine how I want this to look, so I have a plan tomorrow. Or whenever I get around to it. That'll only take, like, 15, 20 minutes. But I think the big thing is gonna be this, like... It's not that I don't like what I did out here, it just thematically doesn't make sense. Because... The villager is running... They're running a diner, and I, I kind of wish I would have realized this sooner. And I think having a diner, like, I'm gonna just redo this as a diner. And maybe just take what I did here, and try to transfer the spirit of it over here. Because if I had that over here, it would make sense, it, it feels like it fits in. And then I would move the diner that I have up there, make it bigger, and put it here. Uh, I've been thinking about this for a while, and I think it makes sense to do. Because then... I could... Probably ditch this fence. In its entirety. And kind of make this so it's like, well, you have the theme park, and then there's like... A diner next door, and it's just one thing. And I think it would look good, like, just continue this pathing here. So it's like a theme park, and it has a retro diner next to it, and even the color palette is pretty similar. I thought about it more and more, and yeah, I'm, I'm leaning towards doing that. It's just gonna be like a hassle, but I think it'll be worth it. So, that's what I'm thinking about. some ideas. And then I guess up here I'll figure out what I'm gonna put instead. Like, th if this is moving, um, yeah, it'll become something else. Not sure what, but I'll figure it out. I have a couple of ideas. 
I think once I see the vacant lot, then I'll be able to visualize it better. All right. Today was going to be a short Animal Crossing session because I want to continue Mario Odyssey. I'm up to the like the dark side of the mood, so we're going to be doing the difficult stuff. Ah <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end and hope you've been enjoying Animal Crossing so far. If you do want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button, or you can also watch me do other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. Either way, it does help out a lot, so yeah, thank you to those who do do that. But we'll do more of this soon. Alright, bye YouTube.